G'day guys, Badge here. Welcome back to the channel. And today we are in Dikey Coast, I think it's called. Let's have a look. Don't know how to pronounce it. That's close enough. And we're right on the coast here, so we're going to go have a look at that. But first we have to open up this outpost over here. It's a bit of a walk. Let's go see what we find. Now, first thing i done when I got here, or well, a few days ago, was open up the outpost and ride my ATV around shooting bears with the pistol. But now I have to open up the outpost, and I've got over a kilometre to walk. Great. Okay, I've had a lynx call, and it's not too far away, it's just ahead of me. I'll have a look through the scope. It's just beyond that tree somewhere. I have called it, so I'm hoping it will walk up. I think it will, because it's so close. Just gonna have to sit here, wait, and be very, very quiet because these things are so sensitive. If you make a movement, they will bolt. So let's give it another call. Keep this thing interested. And before we know it, should pop its head up. Come on, boy, where are you? Here, puss, 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 puss. It's there somewhere. Oh, thought I saw movement then. Oh yeah, look at that, it's coming up. We're going to get this now. Well, I think I've hit it in the neck. You can see its head go straight down. And usually Lynx won't run too far. There it goes. It is off. Let's go find the blood. We'll track this thing down. Yeah, easy tracking. Didn't get very far at all. Let's go pick it up. Try and squash this grass down so we get a better look. Maybe if we kneel. There we go. Look at that. I love the faces on these things. They are done so well. So no integrity bonus using the 270 with polymer tips is no good on Lynx. I've got a small herd of reindeer just over this ridge here. And I'm going to use the coach mate on them. I've put that back in rotation although... I'm not so sure about this gun. I'm not sure it suit shoots very straight. I'm not sure if it's got a little bug or not. But sometimes it seems like the bullet goes right through the animal but doesn't wound it. If we're going to persist then we'll see what happens. And there they are right there. Well the coach mate seemed to shoot straight enough then. Although I've still got my reserves about it. And let's have a look for some more reindeer. Yep, yeah, let's get into one of these ones with the 270. Well, that's two wounded. Let's go find some blood. We'll track them down. Okay, that's a fair bit of blood right there. So one of them is pretty seriously injured. I won't get too far. Let's run down here and see if we can track them down. That, it would have ran too far away. Probably in shock. <laughs> Look at all that blood on the ground. Let's find this reindeer. Put it out of its misery. Where are you, boy? Oh yeah, so they're calling in front of me. So, just gonna have to sneak up again. I want to find the ones that I've injured if they're still walking. We'll get them first. So what happens after that? Okay, we're still miles away from this outpost and the coast. But so far, so good here. I'm enjoying it. We've got lynx, reindeer. I've heard wild boar. I've heard a moose call, so so far, and I've got a lot of musty tracks, so I think all the animals are here, and not that one, that one's injured. Well, that worked out well, because that one already had been shot by the way it was hanging its head down. Let's have a quick look around here. We'll go pick him up. See what we've done. But I imagine this should maybe have three bullets in it, I think. Let's find out. 
Now, because I use this gun, I will not get any integrity bonus on this uh, reindeer. Because I'm using a coach, mate, which is pretty much made for moose and bears. Big animals like that, bison. I just wanted to bring it out and see how... I haven't used this gun for a while, and I did hit it three times. No integrity bonus, no score, pretty much whatsoever. Okay, I found the other one. It is down. We've got some movement over there. Let's go pick this up. And this should have the 270 shots in it. And it has one bought. And it's all over Rover. Just a quick look at the map. And we have a lake there, which I'm about to head to. And here's the lake. And we have another reindeer in front of us. Might be part of that herd we just ripped into. It's just standing out there, lollygagging around. Oh, and it smelt me. Couldn't have heard me because I haven't moved. So it smelt me and it's off. Okay, we have come across a big male moose. And he's on the other end of this ridge and sort of can't get up here. He's just standing there. I'm going to use the shotgun on him with the slugs. So I'm going to have to stand here. There he is. Look, see him moving. So I'm going to have to stand here to get a better shot. And hopefully I can see its spine. And we'll go for a spine shot here. Well, it did hit it twice. I was aiming at the spine. I don't think I got it because this thing has run off. Full bolt. Let's go find some blood. And we'll try and track this one down. Oh, did you see that moose run away? Let's have another look. There it goes. And it's not the moose I'm chasing. Also, I have a wild boar down there. So that was a pretty big moose. And it's not the one I was chasing that was wounded and we did have a wild boar down there so now all we need to see really is bears i have heard musty and their tracks are everywhere i seem to like these forest areas musty although i'm not chasing them they're a bit like roe deer to me they're a bit annoying so here's our male moose that we injured should have two slugs in it I was going for the spine let's see how close i got he's a fair size one Antlers aren't too bad, and it is silver. And I did get pretty close to the spine, as you can see. I hit the scapula there, and even the flesh shot hit it right in the top of the back. Might have been the angle, but I didn't actually snap the bone. Okay, in front of me, I have come across another one of those caves that will have a painting in it. As you can see, I was right on the border there just to get to this cave. I'm um, back in Dikey Coast, whatever we call this place. Let's go check the cave out. Gotta love them icicles, what do you call them? Stalactites or stalactites. Top of the roof there. Let's run in, open this up. Of course, I will get no XP as usual. Do I even get cash for this? I have no idea, probably not anymore. Probably get nothing. Let's go open it up anyway. We'll have a good look at this cave. I don't know, pity they don't have a couple of bears protecting these caves, that'd make it more Wonderful more fun for me anyway. But, oh, well, let's check the painting out. Does it look anything like it just showed us there? No, it's pretty hard to see in here, there's full of fog, and it's pretty hard to see the painting. Have a quick look around, and we'll get on our way. Still got to get to this outpost. Which we are slowly getting closer to. There's the map. So, in case you want to find this cave, you can find it now. I just showed you where it was. Spoilers. So let's get out of here and get back to hunting. Uh, as you saw, we had a lynx call, but that is right on the other side of the cave, which pretty much has a cliff in front of it. I'll give it a call, but I doubt it's going to come. But it'd have to jump about... 50 feet down and break both its legs. Or all its legs. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> look at that. Look how high it is. So I don't think the lynx is going to be jumping over there like Superman. Trying to get to the call. What do you think? Okay, there should be a collectible here. And there it is. I've just walked past it. You'll always find a collectible outside the caves. So don't forget to collect them. There it goes. 
All right, we have finally got to the outpost, which is pretty much right on the coast. So once we open this up, I'm going to run down to the coast, and I'm hoping to find a bear or two and some more reindeer. There we go, it's open. All right, well, I do have another lynx in front of me. You do hear them around here, so there is a lot of lynx around this area. And there it is. It's a female just standing there. So we'll use the 270 on this and just try and get it in line and then go for the shot. Just going to have to be patient here. Here we go. And that's what you like to see. It went straight down. So an easy pickup. No tracking involved at all. And just ahead of us is this coast. So this is getting more interesting. I'm actually enjoying hunting around here. Even though it's sort of heavy forested in some areas. I'm not mining at all. Alright, let's reload this thing. Because I do forget sometimes. And that can be a hassle. Let's check what... Oh, it's halfway through the rock. It's been impaled. It's a female for $1,138 and no integrity bonus. I had a reindeer call and it seems to be that I am on a ledge here. This reindeer is right in front of me somewhere. But I can't see it, but I can hear it shuffling around. So I'm probably going to have to get a bit closer and look over this edge because I can't see it out there in front of me. So it's got to be under me. So I'm just going to have to sneak up here. If I'm way above it, I might try and use the pistol today on this thing. Still getting that pistol score up slowly. And soon I will have the rhino gun. And I'll do a video on that. There we go. got a wild boar just standing out there we could take. But I don't want it. Going to go the reindeer. Just going to have to find this thing. It is so close it sounds like it's doing the rumba. Just below me. Just listen to those footsteps. It is so close. So I'm going to have to get right on the edge here. And hope, no my luck, I don't fall off and fall on this thing. That would be funny, wouldn't it, if I fell down and it killed me like that. That would be awesome. All right, we're going to try off the pistol. We're just going to have to spot it. I think I'm going to just going to, have to get a little bit closer, be nice and quiet, slowly make my way to the edge, and hopefully not fall off. Give it another call to get it moving. Yeah, it's just down there. So I'm going to have to get right on this edge or stand up. It's going to be closer. Oh, see, that's what I worry about, that I don't fall off. And there it is. It is running around. We're going to go with the pistol, and we'll see how this goes. Oh, good shooting. That's a lot of blood on the ground. I don't expect this thing will get too far at all. Let's go check it. But it looked like a vital hit to me. So... This should be an easy tracking. And it should be a gun score over 40, which I want and I need really bad. <sighs> and there we go. Watch, I don't kill myself. And yeah, that is a lot of blood. So let's go find this reindeer. Here it is. Just waiting to be picked up. I think I only hit it the once with the pistol. We will have a check. Yep, right through the lung. And I get a score of over 40 for the pistol. Just what I need. So, let's walk down to this coast. There it is right there. It is iced up. But there is some water. But it appears to be beyond the boundary. I've got some more wild balls down here. You get a lot of them on the ice for some reason. I'm not really sure why. We'll give them a call and we'll have a good look around here so what we can find. Oh, that's pretty big out there, isn't it? There's got to be something standing around just waiting for me to hunt it. Ooh, look over there, what's that? 
who got us a pair. First pair of the day. So you know what I'm going to have to do here, guys, don't you? Oh, yeah. Well, I'll see that bear take off. They can run real far, real fast. And I've caught back up to it and it's still on the ice. I don't know what the hell it's doing. It was standing up and, and getting back down on all four. So let's see what it's doing and we'll take another shot at this thing. Because it's the same bear. Wow, that was really weird. It stood up, I shot it, it stood up again, I shot it. At least I think I hit it. I was usually using the coach, mate, which I'm not sure. I'm not, sometimes I wonder about that gun, what the hell is going on with it. But at the moment it seems to be shooting straight, although earlier I did shoot at a reindeer and it seemed like the bullet passed right through it and the reindeer kept running and there was no blood. We got blood now. And we got a bear down. Let's go pick up our first brown bear of the day. You do see a lot of bears down here on the ice in you know other areas of this map i found a lot of bears just hanging around between where the sort of forest stops and the ice begins let's go pick this one up i'm pretty sure it's female i'm not sure what sort of score we'll get now for all those bullets in it we get bronze only partial integrity and that last shot was a doozy hit it in the lung and the heart unbelievable Okay, I've come across a little musty. I will use the 270 to the back of the head on this thing. We'll see how it goes. Oh, tough little bugger. He's run it. Unbelievable. So I'm the first musty of the day. I have heard them. I've seen their hoof prints all over the place. That's the first one I've had an opportunity to shoot. As we can't call them in. And hit it right in the back of the head. And it's a little male. And what do I get? 400 bucks? Great. Okay, I have a bear right here at, on the ice. And at first it was sort of in render distance and out of render distance. So I'm going to have to run a little bit closer. It is really far away. And once I hit this bear, I'm pretty sure it's going to run straight towards me. They usually do that when they're out in the ice this far. So we'll run up, we'll find a nice posse, probably going to have to go prone, yep, I'm going to try the pistol on it when it runs at me, just for some more pistol score. Man, this thing is far away, and as you can see, that drinking zone is out of the reserve. Because the bear was there and I used the binoculars, I've got the drinking zone. So let's lay down. I have to go prone to shoot this thing, I think. I'll give it a call. Because look how far away it is. You can hardly see it on the horizon. It is out of the reserve. So once they do that, they probably won't run out of the reserve. They will run straight back towards me. And it's not really paying much attention to my calls. Looks like it's going to try and nick off, really. So I go prone here. Going to aim it up. And we'll get it angry. What do you reckon? It's real angry. It is running straight towards me. So this is the time where I pull out the pistol and risk my life. Here we go, guys. Let's see if I can get killed by a brown bear.
Yeah, pretty sure I would have lost the integrity bonus there. It has taken a chunk out of me as it run by, but can't blame it at all, can you? So it hasn't gotten far. Probably lead poisoning was cause of death. None of them were very good shots. Let's check it out. Oh, it's a big one. It's a female, and I get like a thousand dollars, so can't really complain. Look at all those bullets in it. No integrity bonus for me. I miss out on that one, but that's my own fault for being a bad shooter. Okay, I've got another bear here now. It is hiding in this bush. I'll try and get a clear shot at it. And uh, nope, no I won't, because it will run off. It will smell me because of the wind there. And it's gone. We've lost that bear. Oh well, not to worry. Well, there we go, guys. The Dikey Coast, Dikey Coast, however you want to pronounce it. Once we got down here, we did start to see brown bears. Our first animals of the day was the lynx. Then we got some reindeer, come across a nice big moose, and saw his buddy. That wasn't the same moose that ran off. Did see a lot of wild boar, didn't shoot any today. I've been hearing mule deer, or not mule deer, musk deer, all day, although I don't really go out of my way to hunt them. There is a lot of them around here. So you do have all the animals here that are in the reserve, away down here, and this coast bit looks really fine. I want to walk right along it one day and see what we find. I'm sure we'll find a lot of bears and reindeer and wild boar hanging around the ice. There you go, guys. You might want to get down here if you haven't been here, open it up and have a hunt. It's pretty interesting. You do have a really heavily wooded forest area, then it does open up to the odd frozen lake. An area that seems a bit barren. Then you get down to the coast here, and it is just fantastic. And as you can see, it's going dark. Better finish this video. I hope you enjoyed that, guys. And if any of you are having a problem with the coach, mate, put it in the comments. I seem to have a problem every now and again. It's really good close up. Every now and again, it seems to fire a magic bullet. Which goes right through the animal. Unbelievable. Okay, guys, thanks for dropping by. And I'll catch you on the next one.